Welcome back everyone, General Turney here, your host, coming back with a brand new COC episode and welcome my friends to the Dragon event which actually just landed inside of the game a couple of hours ago. So everyone has been super excited about this guys and uh, we're going to see if we can complete it right now inside of this episode. So check it out, if you go into the events page you can see the Dragon event has just actually started. So train dragons at a discount and complete the event challenge. Now the actual challenge itself guys is to you know win multiplayer battles but the actual catch is you have to use a minimum of four dragons every battle and you have to win, you actually have to win three battles in a row guys. So a minimum of four dragons if you actually manage to complete the challenge in two days or less you will receive 300 experience points and 30 little green gems which is uh you know it's okay it's fair enough i suppose it does seem a little bit easy to be honest with you guys but hopefully supercell make harder events throughout 2017 but the best thing about this guys is the actual cost discount so check it out from 46,000 down to 4,600 now obviously that is only 10 percent of the original price guys so no matter what level your dragons are Mine are maxed out level 6, you will only be paying 10%, so that means anyone that's farming, you are going to have a sweet, sweet 2 days on the game because you have a huge discount on dragons and you may as well take advantage of it. So we're going to get ourselves into this dragon challenge, we are going to attempt to complete it in this episode guys, let's see how it goes down, 3 battles, 10 minutes, let's get this done. So just before we do get ourselves into the live action, I actually have a pretty sweet announcement to make. So for those of you that have been subbed to the channel for a while, you will know I make 99% of my videos on an iPhone 6. Well, I've actually just upgraded to an iPhone 7 Plus. It's bigger, it's bolder, it's better, and we are definitely going to be using it for, you know, all of our videos from now on, guys. So we do have two phones, and I don't need two phones, so we're going to give away our iPhone 6. Now it is pre-owned, I have used it for a couple of months guys, but it's still brand new condition. I really take good care of my things. So this is what we're going to do. It's going to be the most random giveaway ever. If you want to win an iPhone 6 guys, simply go down below in that comment section and comment, comment hashtag brown banana. So simply comment hashtag brown banana, smash a like on this video guys. You have to leave a like on the episode and you have to subscribe to the channel. So leave a like, sub to the channel, make sure you sub. And comment down below, hashtag brown banana. Next Friday, we are going to do a face cam. Inside of that face cam, I will randomly pick a comment who has commented, hashtag brown banana. And uh, you'll win the giveaway, guys. So it's as simple as that. So let's get ourselves into this challenge. Good luck to everyone who enters. And uh, let's hope that all of you can complete the dragon challenge. So we're actually going to start by using 12 dragons. I don't know why I've got 12. To be honest with you. They're, uh, they're, they're awesome, but um, let's get a screenshot. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Let's go back. Let's get a screenshot, guys, for um, for actual, uh, what, what was I going to say? For, uh, you know, for, for thumbnail purposes. By the way, if any of you are wondering, like, Tony, why have you barely got any apps on your phone? Obviously, guys, I've only just, like, bought this yesterday, and uh, it got sent to me in the post. So we just got it yesterday, and, um, yeah, so there's not really much on there. But let's get ourselves into this challenge. So we're going to see if we can find a decent amount of loot. Obviously, we are still farming. But I do want to get this challenge down because I actually want to farm using the dragons as well. Okay, here we go. No, that's not that great. Okay, we'll be back in a second, guys. Once we find a base which doesn't look too scary because, you know, Tony's kind of scared. Okay, so we've been searching for, you know, about 10 bases now and I really can't find any great loot. Oh, saying that, we'll land straight on this. Awesome. Absolutely awesome. Maybe I'll do that a little bit more often. Wow. It's also got easy access to two air defenses, which is pretty cool. And then that means we can actually sweep across from maybe the other side of the base, guys. This could be great. I'm hoping I don't mess this up because I'm I'm pretty crap at this. But let's see if we can do this. So we're going to drop a dragon in there. And I'm thinking that's just going to, you know, funnel in all those buildings. So I'm hoping. Let's just wait and see what actually happens with this dragon. We're going to wait for this dragon to actually pass away. RIP Dragon 2017 to January 6th, 2017. If, that, if this can take out that expo, I will be over the moon. If it can actually take out an expo, guys, I will be so happy. Okay, so we're going to start this off by dropping in the Barbarian King and the Archer Queen just behind. They're going to hopefully take out some of these buildings. That dragon should, you know, just continue to sweep across, guys. The Barb King going in there, doing some sweet damage. There goes the, uh, the, the building there. There goes the wall, sorry. There goes the Barbarian King's ability. Looking to take down both these air defenses. If we can actually grab them, Plus that archer tower on the right hand side, that would be sweet. Oh, check out that little cannon, did you see it? So the barbarians have actually landed on the air defense, guys. There goes the second one. And that means now, of course, 
that we can actually, you know, maybe funnel into the center. So we're going to drop down. We're going to pop the queen's ability now. And we're going to send in just two more dragons to take out those buildings there. We're also going to send in two dragons on the right-hand side. And that means the rest of them can hopefully funnel into the center. Now, remember, you actually have to complete the, uh, the challenge by winning these battles, guys. You cannot just participate. You actually have to win. And uh, that's going to allow us, I think, to funnel the rest of the dragons into the center. So here we go. Rest of the dragons going to go in, guys. We got a haste spell. We got five rage spells. I didn't realize we had that many. Here we go. Grand Warden's ability is going to get used right now, making sure that these dragons do not fade away. Here we go. Another rage spell has just gone down. Dragons making their way deeper into this base. Here we go. Another rage spell. Another rage spell. These dragons are under rage. They are tearing this base into pieces. 50% has been secured. Two stars secured, guys. But of course, we are looking for that loot. And I need to take out the Inferno Tower. Single target Inferno Tower. Unfortunately, they are the, uh, you know, the death of the dragons, guys. And they've actually managed to really hurt me inside of this raid. But you know what, guys? We still managed to secure a 59% two-star, and we got the loot, that's important, plus we got the victory, which is, you know, to complete the challenge. So check it out, we actually grabbed well over 1 million loot, it's like 1.5 million loot, so that's pretty damn sweet, plus it doesn't cost us anything really to actually do the raid. So we're going to get ourselves into another attack, guys, this time we're going to switch it up, we're going to bring some baby dragons, going to go with 8, maybe 9 big dragons, and then some balloons, balloon! We're going to bring eight balloons, and we're going to bring... Did we bring... Let's go for three. A rage spell, a free spell, uh, a haste spell, and an extra rage. So that's going to get that. And then, of course, we need to gem ourselves the... Um, ooh! We could possibly run out of gems here. That's a little bit awkward. So we're going to actually make the next army, just in case we run out of gems, guys. So by the time we actually come around to doing it, hopefully... You know, it'll actually be out of the way. So we're gonna use we're gonna use a, a, you know twelve dragons inside of the final one as well. So here we go. We're gonna choose. May as well go for five rage spells and and a hate spell, guys. So that's the final one as well. But let's just get these heroes ready. So we got the troops. We've got the spells. Let's gem ourselves these heroes. So Barbarian King's gonna cost thirty gems. Grand Warden's gonna cost thirty gems, and the Queen, please be cheap, thirty one gems. Okay, so that's cool, guys. Now we're ready to get ourselves into this second battle. Let's do this. Here we go. Let's do this. Don't forget to go down below in that comment section and comment hashtag brown banana and let me know what you think about these challenges also. So check this out. Not bad loot. Not bad loot, but we're looking for some more gold. We want some more gold in here. Let's see if we can find a little bit of a better base. Town or 10, not really that great, guys. We are challenging ourselves here, looking for a challenge. So once again, we'll be back in a couple of seconds once we find a decent base. If we don't manage to find one, then we're going to do that thing where we come back and we choose the fifth base and attack that. So uh, we'll be back. Stay tuned. Okay, check this out. So we've actually just landed on this uh, this Town Hall 11. Now, this was actually my, uh, my most hated base that I actually ever came up across inside of War. Because they actually used to put the Town Hall where the Dark Elixir is. This time they put the Dark Elixir where the Town Hall is. And what I'm going to try and do inside of this one here... I'm not really sure what we should attempt because it it looks a little bit scary but um we're gonna be brave we're gonna be a brave boy and we're gonna see what kind of damage we can actually do to this base guys so i'm not sure what we're actually gonna try because it does look kind of scary but we're gonna simply drop up a dragon at the top just to see if we can grab some actual percentage points so obviously that archer tower is going to be a bit annoying but hopefully it takes it out in a second let's see what happens the air defenses are quite far guys so shouldn't be too much of an issue. We've also got two baby dragons and the eight balloons. So don't forget about that. Dragon's going to take us, you know, up to, what, five, maybe six percent before he gets taken out. Unless he swings to the right and does take out those collectors. Could be a little bit sweeter. Here we go, guys. So it looks like he's going to get us a little bit higher than I first predicted. So we're going to leave that dragon to do that. We're then going to start off with uh, the two baby dragons on the right hand side and the left hand side, just like that. They're going to clear those buildings. Then we're going to go two more dragons. Oh, we could find ourselves in a little bit of trouble here. There goes the Grand Warden. And there goes some balloons. So let's see what we can actually do here. Here we go. So we're going to drop in a Rage Spell really early, guys. Just because we've got four of them. So, you know, we may as well get these Rage Spells and stuff out of the way. So here we go. We're going to hold the Grand Warden's ability until we get right near those, um, those actual Inferno Towers. Actually, we're going to do it now because I don't want those dragons on the right-hand side to die. So check it out. Here we go, guys. Another rage spell is going to go down. See if we can get these uh, these balloons funneled into the center. Here we go. Balloons have arrived. 
There goes another Rage Spell on the right hand side. Can we take out these Inferno Towers? Check them out. Both Inferno Towers on such low hit points. But neither one actually went down. That was pretty damn insane. That's so frustrating. That is really damn annoying. So uh, the dragons are going to die. No point trying to save them. We still obviously have the heroes. That Inferno Tower is so annoying. That was so damn annoying. But check it out, guys. So which side should we take on? I think we could possibly... I don't know. Could we grab the Town Hall? Let's go for it. I mean, there's no time like the present, guys. So here we go. Gonna drop down a Rage Bomb, hoping both heroes can actually get inside of this Rage Bomb. Barbarian King's been annoying, and so is the Archer Queen. Here we go, finally pulling inside of the Rage Bell, guys. Barbarian King, what are you doing? Okay, yeah, that, that was so damn bad. Okay, yeah, he's not gonna go anywhere near it. But we got a one star, which is all that matters. I'm not gonna lie, I did want to get the Town Hall, guys. But obviously, let's end it there. Let's, let's just end it there, because I don't have many gems. And um, obviously, we're going to have to wait for the heroes, guys. So let's go back into the events page and check it out so far. So two out of three in progress. Last one. Let's get it done. So if we go into our army camps, guys, we have six dragons trained so far. There is still a boost on that, but we've only got 13 gems. So uh, we're going to have to try and be a little bit tragic here and see if I can afford a pocket full of gems. 99 cent. Do I have it? Let's check. So we don't have the uh, the credit, of course, which means hashtag Tony is broke. And you know what that means? That means we're going to have to do this challenge the old school way. Possibly no heroes. Let's see if we can do it because I don't want to go and buy more gems because that's going to take like 10 minutes. And uh, we don't really have time to waste, guys. So we got 16 gems for that and 19 for the dragons. We're going to have to be extremely cheap here. Let's see if we can actually do this. It's going to be funny. Okay, so we're going to drop the dragons right down. And uh, we're going to bring, you know, some barbarians instead. So this is this is so dodgy, but it's going to be funny. Let's see, guys. So we got, how many gems have we got? We got 13, so we can afford to gem the army. But then also, oh, didn't mean to do that. We also want to gem ourselves the spells, guys. So check it out. Brew the spells. Let's just cut out the, uh, the haste spell. Let's gem ourselves that rage spell back into the training of the troops. We only have four gems. So, um, going to drop down that dragon. There we go, guys. Four gems. Let's see if we can do this. Barbarians are getting cut down. We still have 41 spaces, though. We're going to bring some more barbarians. Here we go. I've got an idea. We can cut some trees. Let's do this. Let's find some trees. Oh, we don't have any trees. Oh, damn. We're in so much trouble, guys. We've got four gems. Okay, you know what? We're just going to cut these barbarians until it goes to four gems. Here we go. It's going to hit four gems. There we go, guys. Army is ready to take into battle. So if you've made it this far into the episode, comment down below. Hashtag good luck, Tony. And let's get this challenge out of the way. Barbarians, we're going to wait for it to go to 20. Let's do this, guys. So total, we are bringing eight dragons, five rage spells, 60-ish barbarians. Let's get this challenge done. I know I can do this. We can do this. Oh, we got this. We got this. This is going to be easy. Check it out. Searching for opponents. We're going to hit the first base. Yes, we can do this. Tony, I believe in you. I really believe in you, Tony. I know you can do this, mate. I know you've got it. You've got this down. Here we go. Dragon on the right-hand side. We're going to follow up with some barbarians on these uh, these little buildings here. So let's do this, guys. Here we go. Not going to send in too many. Rage spell's going to go down on barbarians. Let's see what raged up barbarians are going to do. So we got the dragon over on the right-hand side. Barbarians, you suck. Okay, let's just drop in a couple more, guys. Take out those buildings. We are after percentage points here after all. Here we go. There we go. Buildings have gone down. Dragon kind of in range and in serious trouble. If he can grab one more building, I will salute you, dragon. Here we go. There we go. We got another one, guys. And he's got to go. Oh, so close. Okay. So that wasn't too bad. We're going to do the same. Should we do the same here? Let's do this. There we go. Another dragon. And we're going to do one dragon up there. And we're going to do one dragon there. And we're going to do one dragon there. One dragon there. There and there. So there's all the dragons. Eagle Artillery. Oh no, it's Woken. It's Woken, guys. Here we go. Rage Spell's going to go down. Going to back up this dragon here with uh, the Barbarians and a Rage Spell. Here we go, guys. Seven Barbarians are remaining. What are we up to? We're up to 32% uh, so far. Here we go. We're doing it. Rage Spell. Come on, dragon. Nope. Yeah, we, we lost. We lost. 
So we are going to win this episode here, guys, because I'm actually going to go and get some more gems. Because, you know, we can't really operate a YouTube channel without gems. So obviously the uh, the dragon event isn't complete because I lost. But uh, there will be another episode coming, so stay tuned. Leave a like, subscribe to the channel, hashtag BrownBanana. Good luck. Peace out.